Happy Monday to y'all. From Georgia. Yeah, we are still. in Georgia still. Delivered this morning. Yep, got uploaded first thing. Yep. And now we're at a pilot. Ooh, we stopped Ooh. at a Target after we delivered on the way to this Ooh. pilot. And I hit the jackpot. I got toilet paper, hand sanitizer, and disinfectant wipes. <laughs> Feeling lucky. I you need didn't to have play, to fight nobody for ticket. them. I didn't have to fight nobody. There was a line though waiting for the toilet paper and the disinfectant was wipes. Was there really? There was. Oh, I had yeah. to wait in a little bit of a line for them. They were <laughs> unboxing them because I got there right when they opened at eight. Yeah, that's that like gold mine these days. <laughs> I know. You, I was, you get happy when you find that stuff. Yeah, I was very surprised. We do not have anything lined up yet. Not yet. <laughs> we have the hopes of one being lined up. Yeah, we called the, or you called the agent while emailed I was in Target. Her. Emailed I emailed her, her. Was in yeah. Target that works this area. Yeah, and let her know that we're, we're dropped off, available. She said, don't go far. We may get you one. Yeah. Out of where you dropped off. So, so fingers crossed. Yeah. We'll see. There's yeah. like, what, I, two things came across the Qualcomm? Not around here. No, all out, out west. Yeah, but it's a beautiful day here. Not a cloud in the sky. Temperatures are nice. Yeah. 60, I think, right now. Maybe we're, we're kind of like in a shaded spot, too. So It got chilly. Last night. Yeah, too me. I got hot, though. She made me sleep on the inside, and I got <laughs> hey, I out. I gave you the inside like the two nights before. You did. You did. <laughs> I had to get up and turn the fan on, and as soon as I did that, she closed her window, and I'm like, I had all this cold air blowing on me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, I love it. Yeah, because we'll usually turn the, the, the ceiling fan thing on to pull air out. Yeah. So then if we have the windows open, it, it sucks the cool air in. Oh, I love it when it's that cold air. Yeah breathing oh so yeah love it. i love i love those fantastic fans man they work good too i know there are some people like um when they see us cooking in the truck or the cooking videos i'll get comments like uh doesn't it stink your truck up cooking in it and mm. no it doesn't because all anytime we cook we turn that that fan on and it yeah. works as an exhaust fan and sucks, sucks all this stuff everything out, out. yeah and even I, salmon we we oh, cook yeah. we cook salmon fish in the truck and sure the it smells, you know, it while smells fishy while you're cooking, but you have that fan going, you leave it going for quite a bit after that, and I mean, it what, an hour like, later, yeah. it never smelled like fish in there. No, so. we'll get out of the truck and come back, and you can't even tell we cooked fish or anything in yeah, here. So, yeah. yeah, I love those fans, and we've yeah. got that one and one in the bathroom, so yeah. it's nice. It's like double whammy. I what, know, it is. You, can, what, you turn both of those things on, it sucks yeah. everything out yeah, of here. Yeah, everything. Yeah, I'm, uploading a video right now. I have a cooking video that I want to edit. And then, I don't know, just a few odds and ends, little things. I want to clean the truck. I wanted to do that yesterday, clean the inside of the we truck. We never cleaned over But the I didn't weekend. get to that, so I no. might do that today. Just kind of chilling, waiting to see if we hear anything. I think I will probably take a nap in a little bit later on this afternoon, just to kind of try to get onto that schedule of yeah staying up after sitting this weekend yeah 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 but well, we'll keep you guys posted we'll see what happens well happy tuesday happy tuesday from georgia 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 welcome <laughs> well we got a load we got a load we got I, two loads yeah actually what happened so we got a call late yesterday afternoon yeah for a load picking up there in georgia close by where here we were in georgia here in georgia yeah we're still in georgia we're still in um georgia. but it didn't pick up till wednesday tomorrow yeah and so we we're like yeah sure we'll do it because it was a good load no deadhead really and then we got a call this morning this morning asking if we could do one going down to florida yeah, shorty. Yeah, they were wanting to know if we could deliver it today, but there was no way we'd make it because the receiver stopped receiving at two. Yeah, and I think when she called, it was like what, <clears> like <throat> ten o'clock almost. Yeah, it was like ten, ten thirty, and I was like, yeah, I don't think so. It's like, well, it's two hundred and eighty miles. Yeah. Yeah, uh, we got two pieces, eight hundred pounds, going mm -hmm. down to Florida near the the Panhandle area, but there was no way we could make it. I called back and I was like, well, can we? pick up both tomorrow and put one in the back and one in our second box then i never heard back from her and then i got the bright idea well we could pick up today deliver tomorrow morning come back up to georgia and pick up by how oh, 
noon, one o'clock tomorrow and be able to grab our other load. So, yeah. and they like that idea. So that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. And you know, it just makes sense. Like he said, it's 280 miles loaded and it'll be 200 miles, 280 miles back. Yep. All miles rate is still great. So it, it, yeah, it's great. That's the one thing about the shorty runs, even though we don't like to do them a lot of times, a lot of times they do pay more right per mile yeah so yeah well i mean i'll tell you it's the shorty ones paying like four dollars a mile yeah a little over four dollars so a mile. doing the load and then back it keeps us at two dollars a mile yeah a little over two dollars a mile so all not, miles, so. not bad you no. know I, I wish we could get those all the time <laughs> yeah. you know it's always like oh wow i wish uh, i'd do those every day yeah. unfortunately they just don't come around every day right but it works out because we still get the other load which yeah. is a good load that picks up wednesday we'll deliver friday yeah. possibly get another load over the weekend but if possibly. not these two loads work out great for the week can yeah, be a decent week yeah. so yeah, yeah i'd and... really like to get one big enough friday <laughs> yeah i know i know fingers crossed it might happen because <laughs> where we're delivering they do have freight out of there so yeah, yeah. you'll find out about that we are gonna work on these two loads first because yeah because the second one ain't in the bag yet right is not in the truck yeah because <laughs> they stop shipping at two o'clock and if we get held up at this delivery yeah. really long and can't make it back then yeah but it's the the next one's picking up at the same place we picked this one up and yeah, it's just yeah. the only reason we really couldn't take them together is they didn't have that second one ready to go yet yeah so it just works out for us to do this and knock it out and get back there and they know we're coming they know we'll be there by two tomorrow so yeah it's it's pretty much in the bag, but no, I, I don't, 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 yeah, don't say that. Yeah, right. Never say that. Oh gosh, but we stopped. Superstitious. At this, I know we stopped at this rest area. Speaking of that, just I know we may have said this before, but a lot of people always ask, why don't you talk about your loads before you pick them up? It's just superstitious because anything could happen. You anything know, anything can happen. Yeah. And we just, I don't know probably stupid but yeah but it's just, you know there's it's, no sense telling you about it and then if something happened it cancels or something yeah, else comes up yeah, it's yeah. just you know that's why yeah and yeah superstition we don't want to jinx it can ourselves. go bad it will right if you uh, put that energy out there of it could yeah so yeah. But yeah, we uh, stopped here at this rest area. It's like one o'clock local time, 1.30 almost. So we're gonna go ahead and do our driver swap. I just let the babies out. They have an RV. What are you doing? Oh, let me make sure that. <laughs> Uh, what is that? I was trying to look at uh, uh, make sure my face uh, ain't all. Oh, that's funny. Um, they have an RV dump here, so we're going to utilize that on the yeah. way out. Yeah. Hopefully, they have water. We can top our water off. We got Chipotle and, today. Ooh, we did. After we, we did get Chipotle for lunch. That was good. Ooh, you, you were just talking to your cousin on the phone. They said they're opening up Texas. Friday. Friday, they said they were allowing... I guess restaurants and movie theaters and all that to open back up. We just pa passed an Outback. Yeah, the, they had a sign that said dining room now open. Dining so, room now um, open. Does that mean a lot of places are going to start opening up? I hope so for the people that have been out of work for all this time. Yeah. So yeah. we'll see, see what happens. Yeah. I, I think people will still be kind of cautious about. It's going to be weird for a while. It is going to be really for a is. while. It really is, but... I think so, too. All right, let's go dump our poop. All right, I need to make me another cup of coffee. Right. Do my pre trip Happy hump day! Happy hump day. We are loaded. <laughs> we are delivered and loaded. Delivered and loaded, yeah. We did not... As soon as we deliver, we we're gone. Yes, we got offloaded about a little bit before eight in Florida, booked it back up to Georgia. But what we didn't realize. Oh gosh, yeah. It was actually nine o'clock in Georgia. <laughs> and we had told them we were gonna be back between one and two. Yeah. Which technically on our time we were. <laughs> Central time. Yeah, but we got there about, what was it 2.30? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so got loaded and we are going back <coughs> up to North Dakota. Back we, up north. Yeah, three pieces at 900 pounds. So lightweight. Lightweight, lightweight one. Yeah, back to the lightweight ones. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, we are loaded and rolling. We are. We just stopped at this rest area. They have an RV dump. We're going to dump the pot, let the babies out. I already made my coffee. Stuff. Yeah. On my second cup today. Yep. I usually have about two to three of these a day because I'll make one in the morning. I make one when I take over and then I make one on my 30 minute. Really? Yeah. Golly, that's a lot of coffee. I know. I'm like, I, like my, I like my coffee and my tea, and I don't drink any of it sweetened. I mean, unsweet. Unsweet. Yeah. I'm sweet enough, as Jason would say. I always say. That's his go-to line. That, that's my go-to line whenever we uh, go out to eat. <laughs> When we used to go out to eat, you know? when stuff was open, <laughs> to go out to eat. <laughs> uh, they, uh, I'll ask. For, I always order iced tea. I never drink nothing else. And they always ask, uh, sweet or unsweet? I say uh, unsweet. I'm sweet enough. He does. <laughs> I never get old. I get it from. Uh, I got it from that movie Snatch with Brad Pitt and. Um, Jason That's his Statham, favorite my movie. favorite movie. Yeah, he time. can recite that movie in his sleep. I, I could. I really could. <laughs> I got it downloaded on my phone and my oh, tablet. Do you? Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I know we have it on DVD in the Airstream. You got it on DVD. And, and, uh, oh, yeah. If you haven't seen it, it's snatched. It's uh, good. It's, it's got yeah. Jason Statham, Brad Pitt. Um, it's got couple, a lot of. Uh, a couple, yeah. Actors. It's a Guy Ritchie movie. Yeah, it's it's a good movie. Yeah, it's. Comment below if y'all have seen it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Best movie ever, I think. We'll be uh, up in North Dakota probably late tomorrow night because it's about 1,740 miles. We'll get offloaded Friday morning and see what happens. Jason's already talked to the agent up there to let him know we're coming. So yeah. we'll see. see if he we says can. they got stuff if we can just get them to ship it. <laughs> They're, uh, yeah, if we can get them to ship it, then, we can, then we'll have a load... Uh, Another load for the week over the weekend, but yeah. we'll see. But if not, I don't mind sitting up there over the weekend. It'll no, probably nice be nice weather. weather so. Yeah, and it's humid and hot down done. here. It is down here in Georgia and yeah, Florida, Florida when we were delivering. I was out Florida, there. I was like, Georgia, oh man, it's humid. It's, uh, yeah, it's not not nice. Yeah, but I guess we'll go ahead and end this one here. Cool. Pick up the next one on the way to North Dakota. Cool. All right. Thank you guys as always for watching and subscribing. Until our next video. Peace, love, and expediting. Mm -hmm. You guys ready to go outside? You need to go potty? You need to go potty? Hey. Let's go potty.